Okay, so today I'm going to show you how to make custom boot and restore logos for your iPhone. First, what you need is Winpwn. Oh, you can't see it. Anyways, Winpwn 2.5. Then you're going to need Photoshop. Right here. Just download the free trial. And once you download it, Start a new file, and the pixels will be thirty. The width will be thirty-two. The height will be um, sorry. The width will be three hundred and twenty. The height will be four hundred and eighty. And then it should look like this. Then you download an image from the internet, whatever you want. And I already have some, I'll show you them. These are all my images. I'll send them to you if you give me a message. If you want to use them. Anyway, so I'll pick an easy one just to show you guys. Oh, and uh, I'll show you my phone. See? There it is. Anyways, uh, so I'll pick an easy one. Let's say we use Ryu. So what you do is you resize it. So you resize it, you go into images and then image size. And he's 21. His height is 2160. So you're gonna, with the width, you just change it to whatever. Uh, 250. 250 usually works with almost everything. Then what you do is you select all, then copy it, then go into this page right here, and you paste it. Then what you want to do is you'll grab the magic eraser which is the third one click on the white border oh by the way when you're making um, the first layer this the the background the big one the 320 by 480 make sure the background is set to transparency or else it won't work so what you do is you delete the background from the picture and then what you want to do is you want to go into file save for for web and devices and this should pop up and down here it should tell you how big the picture is he's 37.29 kilobytes which is good uh, it only works if the image is smaller than 100 kilobytes it won't work if it's bigger and then right here you make sure everything's on PNG 24 Make sure transparency is checked and you save it. Save it to wherever you want. I'm not going to save it because I already have them saved. Um, I'll try to show it to you. Huh. I guess I don't have them saved here, which is odd. Oh, wait, yeah, I do. He's right. He's right here. So I'm not going to save him. Just going to cancel it. I'm going to close all this. And then you open up WinPwn. It should work. I'm not sure if it'll work with Pwnage tool. But I know with WinPwn, it lets you make your own. So you make sure Expert is checked. It'll turn red. Then you check, uh, click on whatever device you have. I have the iPhone.
and then what you want to make sure make sure this box down here says browse so then you click on one of the first uh, picture of the iPhone will, will be your boot logo so you choose I'll show you my other ones to show you that they work um, which one would be a nice one for you guys oh I know there you go see and the restore logo there's Mega Man and then you just continue on with your process and if you have any more questions just ask me about it and I'll help you guys and if you want some of my images then just send me a letter with your email address and then I'll send them to you that way. Thanks for watching.